in fourth place with 58.38 under her belt. She is getting to uh, Ballad in F minor. A bit of Chopin for us. It's uh, Maria Artemiev for Russia. Now she skates well here. It could be a Russia 1-2-3. Solid start, triple it's double toe. Oh, down on the loop. track with a really solid triple toe. And another one in combination. Lovely steps and interpretation. down on the double axle. Got some guts, this kid. That's the triple Lutz. And again, down on the double axle. Would you believe it? It's a beautiful program, there's no doubt about that. And uh, Penny, for your thoughts. Oh dear, three falls in that program and two of them on double axles. Quite incredible. After the short program, I thought she was gonna really nail this. Yeah, first to skate on the short program, that lovely outfit, the, uh, the tango from Coco Chanel, the soundtrack was in the short. And again, she comes out with a different fashion statement here, something to help her stand out 
from the rest of the competition and that really works beautiful start with the Lutz and the toe loop together and then down on the loop after that and trying to get it back and lovely steps it's beautiful artistry love the balletic quality of the skating but some you win and today some you don't quite win you win or you learn yeah it's gonna be a tough one this uh, she's gonna be uh, dropping a fair bit three deductions don't forget that's gonna hurt her when it's working, goodness me, she is a, a joy to watch. She has such a beautiful line coming out of the jumps when they're working. That was the triple loop that uh, she went down on. Skating skills, the super transitions. Yes, just, just perfect. Here's the toe loop. Looking at that, you'd think, well, she couldn't miss. Just a, a really glorious technique. The little deft touch with the wrist turning to forwards and then moving on every little movement adds. Courtney Hicks is leading at the moment. She had about a two and a half point lead over Maria going into this, so fancy the court is still going to be leading after this score in fact she's definitely going to be leading no doubt about it just to remind you it's Courtney Hicks for the USA leading May Berenice Miete for France in second then Samantha Cesario for the USA in third we've got three skaters still to go the top three remember uh, one of uh, Maria's hobbies is psychology and uh, the psychology of performance applies across all sports, all areas, of course, but here it's how you take this and move on. Yeah, she needed 114.21 to take the lead. She's uh, into third place at the moment, a season's best for her, but uh, not great news, but good news for Courtney. She's still in front. <laughs> 